Hello everyone, I am Mihaela from Atelier Miko and today I'm going to show you how I created this glossy 3D painting. For this project we are going to need a canvas, mine is 30 and 30 centimeters, wood glue, fabric. For the fabric we are going to use a special kind which we linked in the description. Red acrylic paint, painting brushes, a staple gun and a glossy varnish. I will leave in the description of this video all the materials we used. First we are going to use the wood glue, we are going to mix it with water, half part water and half part wood glue. We are going to mix it really well until it gets like a paste and it's smooth. We start applying water on the canvas so the wood glue sticks better. After that we apply the wood glue on the canvas. Then we are going to take the fabric, put it on the canvas and start spraying it with water. Because this is a thick fabric, going to need to add water so it can absorb better the wood glue. After you have applied water on the fabric, you start applying the wood glue with a paintbrush. For this step, you have to be careful to spread the wood glue evenly so the fabric can absorb it better. Check underneath the fabric to see if it had absorbed it. After you made sure you spread the wood glue everywhere, you start modeling your painting. to create clean vertical shapes but they were moving and wouldn't stand still so I used some hooks to make them remain on the position I wanted After that you have to let it dry overnight. After 
after it had dried as you can see the fabric is very strong so now we have to start staple it on the canvas frame we start by cutting the surplus fabric on the edges then we start folding it and then we staple it with a staple gun Because this material is very thick, I won't apply a wall primer. So before we start applying the acrylic, we have to be sure that it's really clean, that you don't have any imperfections. Take a clean brush and wipe the dust off it. this project this is the acrylic I used the color it's called carmine I put it in a glass so it can be easier to apply then I took a clean brush and started applying it it looked after one layer of paint after that I applied two more layers so in total I had applied three layers of acrylic paint For the last part, after it had fully dried, we dust it off with a brush and then we start applying the glossy varnish. The 
glossy varnish I used. If you would like to use the same product, you have a link in bio with it. So we start applying it easily and be careful to apply it evenly everywhere and also be careful not to have any liquid drops on the edges. Here is the final result. Thank you so much for watching and make sure to subscribe to our channel and like this video. And also if you know someone who would like to try creating 3D paintings, you can also share this video with them.